Well, hello, ladies and gentlemen. Tis I, the Jabbery Magpie, bringing you a spot more Shadowrun Dragonfall. Now, it has been bloody months since I've actually done any recording of this, so I vaguely remember we shot a Nazi in the back of the face, and Mr. Tumnus exploded, but he's obviously got much better. So, uh. Eh. Yeah. Talk to Ramstall, notify Samuel of the humanist plot, and, uh, we need fifty grand. Oh, a maintenance worker. Hello, sir. Hey, buddy. Sorry to bother you, but I could use some help over here. Wanna make a little extra scratch? Shouldn't take long. Ah, oh, yeah, certainly, Mr. Fucking grimacing bastard. Well, me and my buddy Victor got called in from the next kit's over. Something's wrong with sewers around here. Your local plumbers and mechanics are all useless. Vic and I talked to him, tried to get him to give us the maintenance schedule for your sewer pumps. They just scratched their heads up at us, said that the machinery down there just took care of itself. I am not parading around a magical fucking sewer. My best guess is that your pumps have shut down. Happens from time to time without proper maintenance. When the pumps shut down, the waste starts piling up and it causes some pretty major overhaul problems downstream. So, what do you want me to do about it, apart from not care if the next Kiet's over gets covered in feces? Well, Victor went down into sewers while I was getting stuff out of the truck. When I came back, I was about to climb down there, but I heard these awful screams. They went on and on, then they just stopped. I froze up, nearly shit myself, to be honest. Oh, that's handy to do if you're already in the sewer. Well, if you're going to shit yourself, ladies and gentlemen, do make sure you're in a sewer. I don't know what to do. But I can't go down there, not after that. The problem is probably something basic. A clog that needs to be cleared, something like that. Restarting the pumps should take care of it. But no goddamn way am I going in there. If you do the job for me, I'll give you the new yen we were paid for it. I don't need it. You can have it all. I can live without the money. But someone's got to fix those pumps before I can leave. Fine. Money time. You're a lifesaver, chummer. If you find Victor, well, if he's alive down there, tell him I'm sorry. <laughs> oh god, we need to assemble a team. Uh, okay, I'm not assembling our finest mercenaries, just clear out a shitter. The classics. Me, Glory, Iger, and Dietrich. Alright, come on, champs. And of course, Tumnus. Okay, now for an interesting... Oh, a ghostly labyrinth of tunnels and dead-end passageways. Makes up the network of sewers beneath the Kreutz Bazaar. You climb down the ladder into this shallow underworld and reel at the wave of foul smells that washes over you, clogging your sinuses and saturating your clothing. Oh, God, I'm going to have to give... Tumnus a really good clean after this. Oh, it's going to gunge up his servos. As your eyes adjust to the light, you find yourself standing at the edge of a narrow channel of murky grey-green water. The rush of churning water echoes down a tunnel. You catch a flash of motion in your peripheral vision, something man-sized, moving fast, flitting across to the far end of a tunnel. You strain your eyes to see it, but to no avail. The thing, whatever it is, is gone. Oh, goody goody gumdrops. What do we have? Mossberg CMDT. There you go. Iger, you can... Why is it on loan? You're a member of my team. Surely you don't need to be loaned a fucking gun. Don't, never mind. Don't care. Locate Victor Fix Water Pumps. Shouldn't be terribly bad. That looks fairly pumpy to me. Alright, we have two things that can be used here. Something that can be searched, so let's search the Oh, a pile of bones. Meta human bones been picked clean. This looks like a den of some kind with a rather jaunty rag used as a 
flow. It's covered in as a fro. Pardon. Pump one operations control. Access pump status. Pump stopped. South turbine failed. Deactivated. Pump is operational but not receiving full water flow. Okay. Access pump operations. Rerouted to facility central computer. So southern pump is dead. And south turbine is muerto as well. Is it muerto or muerte? Anybody knows Spanish conjugations? Do tell me. Could it be matar? Oh, what was that? That was a weird squeaky sound. A mangled corpse. I think we found Victor. Turbine. Activate the turbine. Need better decking skills. <laughs> Please tell me we have some decking. Decking four. There we go. It's not bad. Decking four. We also need better fucking ranged combat and pistols. Would be good. And also I should probably increase the quickness of my character so I can actually have some more turns. Okay, well. Bypass the safety protocol. Okay. Turbine 1 on. Oh, well, fuck, have used those ghoul things again? Yes, yes, they are. Time nurse. <laughs> Run. Sixty HP. It's not going to be that fucking terrifying. Eat this. Okay, that wasn't good. But he's stunned, so steady shot. I got. See if you can. Ooh. Do we have anything that will strip his bloody armor off? <laughs> All right, give ourselves a little ley line. Boost Iger's accuracy. There we go. Oh shit. Down to the south. Okay, time for me to stop wearing my coward shoes. Uh, time let's move here. Make sure we've got none sneaking up on our flank. Dark shredding girl. Pierces up to two armor. Okay, let's see how much we can get through. Not that much. Okay. God damn it, Dietrich. Oh shit, she can get past. I thought that <laughs> unconscious one was blocking him.
Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. Uh, glory first. You... Uh, rip. That fucker up. have to reload. Dietrich, you just fling the pain his fucking way. Good work. Okay, Tommy. You're going to have to take one for the team there, buddy. should be fine for a while. Not as hideously bad as expected. Okay, I can move here. Take that new shiny shot of yours. Fuck up his day. Patrick over here. Patch up glory. And Thomas, you just miss a point bank range. <laughs> Why is the sewer filled with zombies? You know, like, I live in London and our sewer system's pretty old and. well, Victorian. Oh, fuck. Seriously? Boom. <laughs> yeah, also is pretty like Victorian, but it's not filled with zombies. Which is why I give a lot of my money to a fucking water board in London. Kneecaps. That sounds like a hideous move. I approve. Ta ta, shreddy shreddy ta. Damn it, Dietrich. Phew. Done and dusted. Okay, that's a local ghoul problem sorted. Hopefully, no other nasties are waiting out here, too devour sections of my face. Let's just run under the shitty water. Oh, he looks fresh. Corpse has been eviscerated. Its, legs, its limbs have been torn clean off and its rib cage is oddly deformed. The tattered treads of blue maintenance uniform hang off its chest. What you got on you? You find a well-worn manual entitled Vortung Schandbuch Ausgabe 2042. This book is filled with depictions of turbine and pump cost sections, tools and descriptions of maintenance procedures. A few of the pages have been bookmarked with colourful bits of paper. Yellow bookmark. Detailed in illustration of a turbine cross section. Scrawled in the margin is a number 822896. Green bookmark. Some notes in a language we don't understand, but what you can make out is computer written several times. That must be the terminal password then. Eh yeah, well. That is going to be very difficult to explain to poor old Victor's family. Fortunately, I don't have to do it. Pump controls. Pump operations. Oh, it's central computer, isn't it? Forgot about that. Shame we could have brought Blitz down here. I'm sure he would have loved a sewer. In fact, he would have complained the entire way. Hence the reason it would have been entertaining. 
Oh, fuck. This look. That just looks like an area where it's gonna be something big. Fuck off and nasty. Hmm. In a way, I am vaguely disappointed. Uh oh. Okay, uh, dumbness time. Dumbness. And uh, I'll just be doing the nice coward's thing over here. Glory, you see if you can stun that fucker. Or not. Oh my lord! Iger, you goddess. You might be an absolute asshole, but. God damn it, you're good. Alright, give Glory another boost to AP. Ouch. I haven't. An... Where did you come from? Okay, glory. Shredded wheat. Should I say shredded zombie? Oh, or you could just not shoot fucking glory in the back of the head. Sorry. Dietrich throw fucking nerve bolts at him. Not going well for me. Boom, and he's gone. You're really not very accurate with that move, are you, dear? Okay, I go use the special. You can't patch me up at all, can you? Oh well, fuck up his day. Oh hell. <laughs> Go down, please die. Good boy. Okay, Iger. Good work. And again. Excellent. Dietrich, not going to score there, mate. God damn it, I love sniper rifles. Ah, what do we have here? A pile of shit. 132 new yen. Not that shit. Okay, so zombies came from here, which means... Obviously there can only be good things. Drugs! Just what every maintenance worker needs. Restart the pump, please. Restart the other pump, please. Way blockage clear oh, fuck. A shambling mound of ragged flesh stumbles towards you. There is a look of desperation in its eyes. Please don't shoot. The ghoul's breath reeks of rotting meat. We're not like the others. Okay, okay, relax. Just maintain a nice five meter distance, please, from me. Not gonna hurt you. The ghoul's voice comes out in a rasping sob. Thank you, stranger. Considering my condition, I had all but given up hope. Who are you? I speak for the Kreutz Bazaar's ghoul population. 
the Krieger strain may have ravaged my body. It feebly pours at the grey, pustulant flesh that hangs from its bones. But I have retained my mind. Uh, the Krieger strain? It nods. Of HMHW, the virus that has infected us. That has twisted us into this. Oh, HMHW, from the law, what I was reading, it's like... Uh, it's essentially this disease which is transferred via blood. It's a bit like HIV. I'm not sure if they were trying to draw a parallel there, but... Depending on what metahuman you are, or non-metahuman, it does different things. Like, elves, I think, end up vampires if they catch it. So humans turn into... Z zombie ghouls, so... I uh, don't know what other beasts turn into. We are not monsters, sir. Oh, I can do the elephant, man. I am not a monster. That wasn't very good, was it? We are people of an illness, incurable for now, yet some of us cling to hope. You may think us of lepers if you wish. Ah, uh, keep going, buddy. We've lived down here under a cross bazaar for years, for all this time has provided refuge from the world above. We traded our labour for sustenance, both for ourselves and for our feral brothers, and we survived. But now our food supply has been interrupted, and the feral ones have gone mad with hunger. We're a danger to everybody, even us. You worked for food? Who was feeding you? Was it the sanitation department? A doctor, a topsider from your cross. It's bizarre. He kept us fed. The contract guaranteed it. Under the terms of our deal, we maintain the pumps that keep the Kreutz Bazaar sewage flowing. In return, the doctor gave us medical waste to eat. With proper rationing, we found we could get by on what he gave us. The Decker monitored both sides to ensure our mutual cooperation, but with her death, the doctor has reneged on our deal. Okay, I think I know the doctor you mean, he's a bit of a sleaze. Um, I shall go beat him up for you, cause you seem like a nice bloke, and we do need a sanitation department. Without the food guaranteed by the contract, the feral ones have gone mad, and in the madness they made it too dangerous for us to maintain the pumps. Yeah, was the Deccan Monica by any chance? He nods. Yes, that was her name. Do you mean Dr. Ezekable? Or what's his name? Exible? Oh, I fucking didn't read it. Yes, his contribution kept our community alive, kept us thrive, but now the deck is gone. He is demanding payment for our feedings. We have no money, but he does not care. He tells us that we must find some or he'll let us starve. You have a reason why the sewer system took care of itself? Yes. In truth, we would still work on the pumps even without the doctor's pavement. We love our occupation. It helps us feel human. Oh, that's nice. But the chance of war by the Krieger strain required us to eat human flesh. If we don't, we will run die. Without regular feedings, we will have no choice but to hunt for food. Okay, I think I have a solution. Its milky eyes widen. Yes, please, whatever you can do, our situation is desperate. I'm going to have a little chat to Dr. Eskibal. Yes, perhaps you convince him where we could not. We have a common link providing to us by the doctor, by the decker. To a direct line to Ezekiel's office. If you call him, he will answer. Hmm. Oh, we have to do it on a nearby comm link. We can't just fucking threaten, go pounding on his door and threaten to behead him. All right, let's see what we can do. You pick up the comlink receiver. It's a custom job cobbled together from a jumble of high-end parts. Reminds me you of your mission computer. Monica's handiwork. There is, near, there is a series of staccato clicks as the connection is made. Dr. Ezkabel's voice pours into your ear. It's thick with a blend of irritation and insolence. Uh, what was Dr. Ezkabel's voice again? Oh, no, I'll give him anything. If you're calling me to beg again, you might as well hang up now. 
I've been bled by you people for too long now. There are plenty of other chop shops and organ leggers out there who will pay good money for... Let me cut you off right there. This is Max, Dr. Escabel. Max? Escabel tries to hide the surprise in his voice. He doesn't do a very good job. Oh, what are you doing on this line, my friend? I've just had a very interesting conversation with some of your long-term customers. I, d I don't know what you're doing. Those things have told you, Max, but they're not customers. They've never paid me a thing for my service, and... They be keep the Kreutz Bazaar sewage, sewage running dark. Otherwise, we're going to be knee-deep in complete and utter shit. Well, yes, but I don't know why it's my responsibility to pay for... You signed the contract, and I expect you to honour it. Contracts don't last forever, and you'll forgive me for saying so, Max, but I can see no good reason to continue honouring this one. My clinic is a business, not a charity. I'm not giving your new friends any more biomaterial unless they pay me for it. Alright, well, do you have anything else you want? What, like a barter system? I don't think so. I can't imagine a bunch of sewer-dwelling monsters would have much of value to trade. They're people, Doctor, not monsters. They've been working for the meals. Maybe you can come up with something... with other things for them to do. Hmm, that's an interesting suggestion. The line goes quiet for a moment. I might be able to work with that. I'll tell you what. You tell the leader that I'll, I'll continue feeding them. In return, they'll keep the sewers maintained like they used to. And they'll agree to do odd jobs for me when I call. Just so we're on the same page, what sort of odd jobs are we talking about? Because I'm not prostituting a bunch of ghouls. The sort that a pack of bloodthirsty ghouls might be good at. Use your imagination. The ghouls I've spoken to are intelligent. I don't think they want to do your dirty work. Well, that's tough for them. I'm sorry, but this is my material that we're talking about. If you want to keep getting it, you need to provide me something of value. And you know what? They have nothing else of value to provide. You've heard my offer. They can do what, what I tell them to, or they can find the food somewhere else. It doesn't matter to me either way. Uh, what do I do? Should I say it's too sketchy? Or... Monica wouldn't approve of this. This is too sketchy. Blackmail. His tone is incredulous. Do that and you'll be getting your local ghoul friends killed. The Metbarks will storm down there with their arsenal and wipe them out. Yes, they'll come, but the ghouls will already be gone. You, on the other hand, won't be so lucky. There is a pause when he speaks again. His tone is guarded. What do you mean by that? The knife cuts both ways, Doc. What do you think that your neighbours will do when they find out that you've been feeding human flesh to a pack of ravenous ghouls for over a year? The whole plan was your friend's idea, your sainted moniker. And she's dead. This is how I do business, so tell me what's it gonna be. There's a long pause. Finally you hear a sigh. Tell your friends that I've changed my mind. The meat feedings will resume directly at no additional cost. Ah, uh, I forgot he was a massive coward and could be threatened <laughs> don't worry mr. ghoul you're back yeah I've spoken to Rizkabel you can expect your regular feeding schedule to start up again any day now thank you so much topsider this means more to us than you can know Aww. we did it yay Do all sanitation workers have to, like, fucking pass this test? The Ministry of Health forces you to do negotiations with a bunch of zombies and crooked doctors. Anything else down here? Leave the sewers.
Oh, fuck, we still need to tell this guy that Victor's dead. Fresh air coys bizarre as a welcome relief after your time in the sewers. Cool breeze drifts across the street, carrying with it the smells of food being prepared, cheap alcohol being poured, and fires being lit against the cold. The stench of the sewers, however, still lingers in your nose. A bad ol olfactory aftertaste. At least the pumps are working again. Sewage overflowing into streets would have certainly sm smelled far worse. Yeah... I'm not quite sure the Doctor understands the health ramifications of fucking hordes of poo being jetted into the streets. Naturally, he is a Doctor, so he would make money off said health ramifications. Damn you, Ezkabel, it's all a plot. Drek, finally I was worried that you wouldn't come back either. So tell me, what happened? Everything okay? Yeah, it's taken care of. You can go after you've given me my money. What about Victor? Uh, yeah, sorry. Christ, poor Vic. Don't know what I'm going to tell his folks. Real close-knit family they were. Well, I found this junky maintenance manual. Maybe that will give him some solace. <laughs> Thanks, Fel. Appreciate it. Here's the money I promised you. 500 new yen. Oh, and we can upgrade our... Chaps. Hmm. So, we can get Iger to be... Frag Grenades of Flashbang Specialist. So, let's see what else we have. Better cyber eyes. Hmm. SMG upgrade or accuracy upgrade. Let's just get the SMG upgrade because he's basically is a prey and spray count spray and prey character anyway. Um Let's just get the medicine better medicine Uh for fire elemental Let's go fire element, elemental. And I could do, you can use flashbangs. Yeah, flashbangs would be more useful, I think. The ability to stun a load of enemies. Confirm all. Right, that's our team. Given another little upgrade. And you know what? I think that's a lovely place to leave it, ladies and gentlemen. I do hope you enjoyed that. This is the Jabbering Magpie signing off. And uh, all I can say is a tatty bye.